Uh, many of you know that uh, global education has been part of Onslow County Schools focus for several years now. We've been working as a North Carolina global district in the east and have had some several partners who you'll hear from today. But today we're actually going to be launching for you the formal part partnerships, excuse me, from the state because the state has recognized the importance of global education just as you as educators have recognized the importance of global education. So we have been invited as a district to be part of the Global Schools Network. We're gonna share with you some very special folks that have some opportunities that you may wanna take advantage of as you move your global plans forward and help our students to be globally competitive. Companies are looking for uh, workforces that understand the rest of the world. Uh, student populations who have, have those language skills, who have those cultural skills, those are going to be the workforces who attract business from abroad, who, uh, who build their own businesses and their own ability to compete with the rest of the world and to sell their products abroad. Uh, those, those international skills are going to be particularly important to be able to sell with the world, to interact with the world, to create uh, solutions to global problems around the world. Uh, those students who have those skills are going to be the ones that lead that kind of economy. We really want you to look at this as an education and economic initiative. There were many, many years and during many of our careers that we have not really thought of ourselves as economic drivers. We are. Our schools are, our district is, our children are, our communities are. So as we spring forward with our global initiatives, we're really going to try to emphasize what we can do to help and improve the economic situation that we currently find ourselves in. You will see our partners listed there um, through the Global Schools Network, and those are the formal partners. We have been very blessed in Onslow County to be partners with many folks, and some of those could not be here today. So Worldview, you know, Center for International Understanding, all of those folks who will work with us on our global initiatives, we couldn't do it without our formal partners and we certainly could not do it without all of our Onslow County partners. That the United States has historically been a leader in the world in economy, in education, entrepreneurial work. We've talked about the need for creative thinking, the largest military, the fact that our technology companies are very renowned throughout the world. One thing we need to remember is that didn't happen necessarily because of what we are doing today in education or in our society. It happened because of decisions and things people did 25, 35, 40 years ago. They set a standard during that generation for what they wanted the future to look like. That is what we are tasked with today. As educators, we want to make sure that the work we do is going to set the stage for generations to come not just for today, but for all of the tomorrows.